If you have a phone laying around that you're not using anymore, one of those old phones that you upgraded from and now the phone really doesn't have any value in it, so it's just laying around, but it still has some use in it, you can actually turn it into a remote control for your smart home. It might be a quiet time where you can't just blurt out commands to turn lights on off or set the thermostat or whatever you're trying to do. Turn this phone into a remote control for your smart home. I'm going to show you how you can do that. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is go into the phone, as long as you're not using it anymore, and factory reset it. Put it back to the default setting where there's no app on it, just bare minimum, just the stuff to make the phone function. That will clean everything off it so it will work at its optimal level. Now before you do that, make sure you take everything off the phone that's important to you. Now once the phone comes back to a setup screen, you want to go to the setup procedure and then sign into your app store, whichever you have, Apple or Google and then start downloading all those apps that control all your smart home devices. That include your lights, your thermostat, and any other devices that's in your smart home setup that you can control with your voice. And once you get it all ready to go, because basically this phone is gonna run off your Wi-Fi, so it doesn't need any cellular network, because you're gonna be using this phone within your home, so it's not like you're gonna be taking it out and about to make phone calls or anything like that. So basically all you want is the apps that you're gonna to use to control your smart home devices. And once you got it all set up, you download all your apps and connect them to your smart home account. Now you have a secondary way of controlling your smart home devices instead of using your voice, then you can use your remote now that you have for your smart home and control those devices, lights, thermostat, whatever. Okay, so that's gonna be it for this video. I wanted to share this tip with you in case you have any old phones or tablet laying around and use them for remote, just like I do for my smart home. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I wanna thank you for taking the time for watching this video. Have a good one and I'll see you next time.